Hi everyone, it's Laura. I got my Walmart Spring Beauty Box. I was so excited. Um, I wasn't expecting it this early, so I'm happy. So I got um, version two, and it did have a plastic outer wrap. I took that off already. So before I open it up though, let me quick show you my lippy of the day. It's this MAC one that I got that was part of their Valentine's collection. You can see it's got little hearts all over it. And the shade name is Luck Has It. And it's pretty, it's, you know, just a real soft, like neutral color. But anyway, all right, let's get into the Walmart box. It's Walmart box, it's quarterly. You probably know all this. It's like $6.98 or something like that, $6.96. I don't know. I like getting it because it's inexpensive and it's cute. So it's usually in a blue box. It's pink. I don't know if that's going to be pink from now on or if it's just a spring thing. I don't know, but I like it. So spring refresh. And that has a picture in here of the items that you could get. Sometimes your stuff is in here and sometimes it isn't. It's kind of a crapshoot. So let's just see what we got. Alrighty, I'm not seeing any makeup. Oh well, okay. <laughs> um, first up, I'm just gonna grab stuff out of here, is a little Dove deodorant. And these are perfect for travel. Um, this is Advanced Care. You know, it's a spray deodorant, antiperspirant in Cool Essentials. So it's like a cucumber scent. And this is ice cold. Woo. <laughs> it's been out in the, you know, out in my mailbox. Then I have got um, a shampoo and conditioner set from John Frieda, which I do like John Frieda products. And this is Ultra Filler for Fine Hair Thickening Shampoo and Conditioner. It says it plumps overall thickness by 200% with biotin and hyaluronic acid. Results in one use. Um, oh, I forgot to look at the pricing for the other stuff, but let me just do this first. Full size of these would be $10.97, and that would be 10 ounces, and here we have one ounce. And the Dove deodorant is a full size of $7.48, 3.8 ounces, and this is also one ounce. So then I only got two more things in there. Oh, well. Sometimes there's like nails or a lippy in there. You could have gotten um, a CoverGirl eyeshadow palette, but I did not get that. I did get this Thayer's Water Cream uh, Let's Be Clear Moisturizer. And a full size is 2.5 ounces and it's $18.97. This is one ounce. So this is actually a good size for a moisturizer. Like you'll get quite a bit of use out of that. It says this clarifies skin, visibly reduces pores, and smooths texture with uh, zeliac, I think that's how you pronounce that, acid, hyaluronic acid, and licorice root for combo to oily skin. So my skin is combo in the summertime. Winter, it's definitely more dry. Um, so I'll, you know, set this aside and I'll try it out in a month or two, see how it works for me. And then I only got one other thing. It seems like usually you get more stuff. I got one, two, three, four, five. I don't know. Anyway, I got a mask, Vitamask Electrolyte Watermelon Mask. And these sheet masks, this is a full size. They value, or the value of this is $2.97. Scents may vary, it says. So I got a hydrate version. There's probably a couple of different versions. So some of the other things you could have gotten was a sample of a Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Cream moisturizer with hyaluronic acid, um, a CoverGirl little mini eyeshadow palette, which would have been nice, um, a four color palette or a four pad palette that's $9.98. That would have been a full size um, item. A Garnier Whole Blends Honey Treasures Restoring Solid Shampoo Bar. I'm glad I didn't get that. I'm not a fan of shampoo bars and I don't like Garnier. So no offense to anybody that does. Um, you could have gotten a number seven future renew damage reversal day cream sample, uh, Palmer's coconut oil amino bonding complex bonding conditioning mask. That's a mouthful. Fortified rejuvenating and protecting under eye pads. That would have been nice too. A derma E vitamin C serum. That would have been really nice. I like that. And then the, the Thayer's, which I did get. So um, it's just weird. Usually there's a couple of different makeup items. The only makeup item on here was that CoverGirl palette, which I didn't get. Usually, like I said, there's nails, there's lippies, like an eyeliner. 
something, but nothing, just that eyeshadow, which I didn't get. Oh, well, for that price, I never complain about this box. It's fun to get. I mean, it pays for itself, really. You're just paying for shipping. They say the items are free. You're just paying for the cost for them to ship it to you. But I mean, a mask alone is $3, so the box was like 7 And I'll definitely use the travel size deodorant. If if you guys get these and you're like, oh, I, I never go anywhere, but if you work, take it to work. Because sometimes during the middle of the day, in the summertime, might need a little freshening up. <laughs> Just a suggestion. I keep a little mini deodorant at work. And I'll definitely try out the shampoo and conditioner and the, and the moisturizer. So it's all stuff that I'll try. You know, I probably... Other than the deodorant stuff, I probably wouldn't have bought on my own, especially a thickening shampoo. I mean, I've got a lot of hair, um, but I'll try it. And if nothing else, I'll give it to my mom if I don't like it because she's always looking for that kind of product. So that's what I got in the Walmart Spring Beauty Box. Not the best, but I never complain about this box. It's it's fun to get. So thanks for watching, guys. If you're interested, I'll leave a link for the Walmart box below. It's not, you know, I don't get anything for it for you signing up, but... If you want to check it out, it comes once a quarter. So thanks for watching. See you in my next one. Bye-bye.